And Willingham's in the box. Pitch on the way. Right Swing and a miss for strike one. A tremendous effort out on the mound in this one. And we're deep into the ball game. I mean, we're getting close to the end of this one. They've only been able to get four hits against him, and he shut them down and kept them off the scoreboard. That's a strike. Willingham's going to have to take a big defensive stance. He has great movement on his two-seam fastball to both sides of the plate. That shows he's getting good extension out in front of his body. And Olivo makes the play. One away. Now, no runs so far, and he's been able to make every pitch he needs to to neutralize some of these big bats. Getting the job done, he looks like he's feeling good. Fresh count on De Jesus. Here it comes. Strike Starts one. him out with a fastball for a strike. The key for any pitcher is establishing the four-seam fastball. Once you get that working, it gives you so many different options. Here's the delivery. Oh. And he leaves that one alone. David De Jesus evens the count. Well, that's a tough pitch right there to lay off of. That change up down and away and out of the strike zone. But the hitter must have been looking for it because he wasn't fooled at all. Blow it outside. Two balls, one strike. 2-1 on the way. There's a ground ball. Ryan. Out, out number two. Now, Gary, for every pitcher, it's a little bit different. You know, how long they can go into a game. But right now, he still looks pretty strong right now. Two outs in the seventh. I think he's got a chance to shut them down the rest of the way. And Connor Jackson up. One for two in the ball game. Two outs, space is empty. Here's the pitch to Jackson. Has him out in front as he swings and misses strike one. But when in doubt, when you're undecided, swing hard, and that's what he did. But he got the slider and he swung through it, but a big, powerful swing. And leaves that one alone. Connor Jackson, patience, evens the count. The 1-1. One -one. Fastball gets away from him there, two and one. And this is inside. That got him pretty good. Well, that's going to leave a mark right there. A big old welt on him. He's going to need some ice when he gets back to the dugout. And we're going to see size more here. Oh, Gary, we see that guy get hit with a pitch. I mean, sometimes, listen, as a pitcher, you just lose the grip on the ball. It doesn't come out of your hand the right way. You end up hitting somebody. Here's the first pitch. Oh. Fastball, too low, 1-0. And the question after you've hit a batter like we've seen here, Steve, is as a pitcher getting your focus back. Yeah, but listen, it's only one runner on. Take a deep breath. Oh, get dude. yourself back and settle down a little bit and, and make sure you're right. The 2-0 pitch. Oh. Misses low. Ball three. Well, that fastball right there just missed. Just below the knees. Tell you what, a borderline pitch. I think they wanted that one bad. Right. No doubt about that one in a 3-1 count. Now the hitter's just saying, I don't care. I'm not swinging no matter what. Even if you throw it down the middle, I'm willing to take a walk. Right. Good pitch at the letters and a full count three and two. Full count, two outs. Runner's going to get a head start off of first base. The 3-2 pitch. Strike three. Man, oh man, is he on a roll on the mound, Steve. You can tell by his eyes he's completely locked in right now in absolute control. So they can't figure anything out. And through seven, they remain without a run. And if you just joined our broadcast, great to have you on board. 2K Sports Major League Baseball. I'm Gary Thorne with Steve Phillips and John Crook. Right. And that's a good pitch from Gonzalez that's in there. When you can spot your four-seam fastball to the outside corner, the hitter has to have balance at the plate and not pull off the ball. Strike two. Strike two. Now with 
No balls, two strikes. Franklin Gutierrez will need to be careful. The pitch. Catcher gets a hold of that one in the dirt. One two pitch coming. Good eye by Franklin Gutierrez as he lays off that one and we're even. The two two. And he swings and hits this one foul. The 2-2 pitch. Swing and a miss on the slider. One out. Oh, Gary, that's a great pitch right there. Great command and control. Hitting his spot down and in. It makes it real tough on the hit. It's going to be Figgins now. Popped out of foul territory last time. The first pitch. And it's 0-1. Gonzalez caught him looking on that one. When a pitcher hangs a breaking ball up in the zone, that's the pitch you have to hit. It might even get him off of throwing the curveball and just go fastballs. And he looks at a fastball in there, and it's one and two now. That's well, a good fastball right there. He blew that one right by him. Ball. Low for a ball to Figgins. Well, he tried to change up right there, but it just stayed down and off the plate. That one swung on, hit in the air. And Willingham's there. As he gets to it for the other. It'll be Cart batting. Single and scored his last time around. Two outs and nobody on. Gonzalez sets and throws. First pitch, curveball. Swung out and missed, 0-1. Uh, you know, it's odd, Gary. This guy's down 0-1, and he tends to take this pitch not overly aggressive. I think you got to go right at him and really get up in the count. One one, a fastball inside. Two and one now. Well, the starting pitcher right now is over 80 pitches, and this is a time when the manager and the pitching coach have to keep an eye and see if his velocity is dropping. If it is, you might want to think about getting him out. Hit hard on the ground towards third. Throws on to first in time to retire the side. Not a lot of action in this half inning. Nothing on. 